Let's have a little look then at the Premier League table. Champions Manchester United play Arsenal tomorrow. Manchester City moved a step closer to securing second place with a win against West Ham today. Chelsea are also in action tomorrow. They go into that game hanging on to fourth on goal difference after Tottenham could only manage a draw. At the bottom, Wigan's draw with Spurs means they stay in the relegation zone. Aston Villa have the chance to pile more pressure on the Latics when they play Sunderland on Monday. QPR and Reading play tomorrow. The losers of that game will definitely be relegated and both could be down by Monday evening. Let's have a look at the championship. Hull City blew their chance to join Champions Cardiff in the Premier League. Their defeat at Barnsley ensures the battle with Watford for the final automatic promotion place will go down to the wire. Brighton won to book their playoff place, but the other two remaining places are up for grabs. Already relegated Bristol City lost to Huddersfield, which leaves uh, the Terriers on the brink of safety. Wolves were beaten and will kick off three points adrift of safety next weekend as they battle to avoid relegation to the third tier of English football for the first time since the 1988-89 season. Barnsley won to move three points clear of Peterborough. They play Sheffield Wednesday in the evening kickoff. Doncaster claimed promotion to the Championship after a dramatic match with Brentford. The Bees had the chance to snatch an automatic promotion place but missed a last gasp penalty. They must now settle for a spot in the playoffs. You'll get a chance to relive that shortly. And Doncaster's win also clinched the title at the expense of already promoted Bournemouth, who were held to a draw at Tranmere. At the bottom, Hartlepool, Bury, Portsmouth already down and it was Scunthorpe who joined them uh, to play in League Two next season. The Iron did win today but Colchester's victory over Carlisle sealed their fate in the end. And League Two, where Rotherham and Port Vale will join already confirmed champions Gillingham in League One next season. Victory for Rotherham sees them climb above Port Vale, who could only draw today. Uh, Burton will play Bradford in the playoffs, with Cheltenham taking on Northampton in the battle for promotion. And let's have a look at the bottom. Aldershot could not find the win they needed. They're relegated out of the Football League after a five-year stay. And there were no final day heroics for Barnet this year. They'll join the shots in the conference next season. The Bees end the season with an identical record to Dagenham and Redbridge, but are relegated on goal difference. And the SBL. Celtic, who play Motherwell tomorrow, have already retained their title. St Johnston beat Inverness to keep up the chase for a European place. At the bottom, Dundee have staved off relegation for yet another week. The Dark Blues beat Hearts, while St Mirren were held at Hibs.